Ah, he's polite. polite yeah. yeah, and the way he approached, I approached me was very. One time, I was like, "Uma mgongo, uma shingo." I was like. Hello guys, so it's your boy Official Flexes and uh, I'm back again with a new video and of course this is the best loyal test show here in Kenya. Na leo niko na couple lenye to sanitize jana and they happen to be the most loyal couple ever kwa channel yetu. And so tuliona ni vizuri at least we follow them up to an uh, at least they reveal their secrets. They teach us to put lessons. I mean, to put notes to talk about so that up to join. What what does it take for people to be loyal? So I'm going to ask them some few questions at least to add you as idea. My pens it too. Now we to be change. So that kumbusha Gina ona ito anani. Alafu na placeu mezaliwa na placeu naka. Sindia, ni mtu mwingine pia akitaka kutafuta dema na zenda hiyo place pe. Unaitwa dadi I love the place and all that. Naitwa Stephanie, nilizaliwa Nairobi but currently tunaishi Makweni. Yeah. Ni mkamba. Hapana. Bro tumbie sasa wewe unaitwa nani? I love place umezaliwa na place unaka. Uh, oh, so um, my name is Christopher. I was born in Nairobi but kwetu ni Kisumu. Eh yeah, so ni team Mazimia. <laughs> I'm no more of a politician sana yeah. but eh uh, watu wanisema Azimio yani eh eh yeah, I'm a Luo. Yeah. Uh, so actually what brought me here is my mom mm. ali tafuta huko. I was transferred from a polytechnic. The fee was kind of high but yeah. sasa from Kisumu. Yeah. But currently I stay here in Voi. Yeah. That's very nice. So, kwa wale labda wenye wako wana video jana, you'll just remind them your age. Yeah, kitu kama hiyo pia. Um I'm 22 years of age. And I'm 19. 19. <laughs> so guys, how did you meet sasa? Hapo sasa ndio nataka tupate hiyo mazingira like you you met. Yaani hapo hiyo point ya ku meet sasa ndio watu wanataka kujua sana. Um so nilikuwa kwa rafiki yangu akona it was like a saloon na pia at the same time she sells ice pops yeah. I, she makes and tengeneza peke yake na maziwa mm-hmm. so nilikuwa nimeka hapo then actually she also has a bench nje mm-hmm. sasa nilikuwa nimeka kwa bench mm-hmm. nikamona akipita akienda akienda side za shule mm-hmm. so nikamwangalia tu then nikalenga cuz mm-hmm. to some extent mm-hmm. you know, I was kind of like shy kiasi. Yeah, eh, so like nikarudi tena kwa duka then aka ule mwenye duka sasa my friend akamuita. Mm. So ndo kumuita mm. akakuja na ndo sasa mimi nikamwambia ah karibu tunauza ice pop hapa hivi. Yeah. Eh, so nika nilikuwa nadanganya wasi wengi ati hizi yeah. ni zangu mimi ndo nimetengeneza you know. Yeah. So like ndo after kukaribishwa yeah. I, uh, I I noticed she had braces. Yeah. So actually at first they were pink. Yeah. She had pink braces. So ndi ndi kamuliza how much kwa ka braces? Na kaambia 100,000. Na nikamwambia ati si. Hebu kwanza. Was that a lie ama ilikuwa ni ukweli? It's true. Am I told to me nature if cover mom. Aha. 100,000. Mm. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. Kaskia 100k. Kaskia 100k. Eh, <laughs> sasa nika joke yani eh, yani kutunza menu inaweza kuwa expensive hivyo. Yeah. So hivyo tu then akanunua spot akaenda. Yeah. Then she came back baadaye. Mm. Ndio akaambia ati eh na, uko na viatu poa. Hata mimi I'm new here mm. na natafuta plug wa viatu. So like at the back of my mind nilikuwa najua mtu anauza viatu but in Nairobi. Mm-hmm. So nikasema acha nitachukua namba yake, mm. niulize niulize like the price. Mm. But parceling nitalipa mimi mwenyewe. Mm. Eh ndio ikae like wewe mtu wako hapa. Mm-hmm. So ndo she took my number mm. then ndo akanipigia nipate namba yake no we started talking then like two days later ni tukakutana na hapo hivi kwa shop actually i called her tulikuwa tumeboeka generally then she was like anataka mtu akumpeleka town uh, ajue then nikampeleka but sasa unajua voice not a huge town like unajua like Nairobi Kisumu Mombasa 
So after taking a best yangu, alikuwa amekujia something undani from Mombasa. Akaniita Caltex. So ndo tukaenda hapo tukapiga story we lost track of time. Hapo nilizima actually. Yeah. And kumbuka she is new. Hajaka one ma, one week huko hata. So tukaenda nyumbani saa tatu. Nikampeleka kwake saa tatu. Apparently mamake alikuwa anamtafuta. So eh yeah. so ndo roommate wake akamwambia, "Eh hey, mama amekutafuta maani hivi hivi washa simu umongeleje so like the mama kamongeleja kind of like strict kiasi so vile mimi nilikuwa home akanitext akanambia mama amenigombanisha and she was crying nikamuliza is your roommate okay ni kuje i come over cuz you know generally it was my fault i got a lead so then she was like okay acha nimuulize ni akauliza then akasema it's okay and mark you hiyo time bado kafi ilikuwa so i had to run from my place to her place at night sasa ilibidi nipite kwa reli because unajua reli is relatively safe na nigiza so ndo nikakimbia nikampata then i spent the night hapo kwake for some time then later on she moved out but the same plot too she moved out to a new house but she was kind of scared you know she she had anxiety haizi lala peke yake so ni kaambia okay fanya hivi come sleep at my place if your mom calls just tell her the truth mwambie tu you at my house then the mom called kaambia sawa basi but kesho arudi nyumbani so ndo akarudi hizo times ilifika point yenye mama yake ataki nikae na hadi mama yake akaniambia atanichukulia restraining order so but you know that didn't stop me so like Ivo to started hanging out eh, then nikafika point where kaishi kwa tukahama tuka, tuka sasa like naishi kwake mimi ndo nili like relatively ngo zangu ziko hapo like yeah. most of them my shoes and stuff yeah. so sasa zingine we go for sleep over at my house sasa zingine tuko hapa kwake but all of the time niko na eh, eh, we stay together eh hey, story da kafiti mzee hey, hey, hey. yani at least one event leads to another one yani napenda hivyo sana mami why did you give him this chance like just after that a simple question mpaka mkafikia hasa kuone eh this guy is safe with me hata niko safe kwake um at first i was like i was from a heartbreak time yeah. i was healing yeah. so like i was not interested in like dating and all yeah. but then yeah. This one, <laughs> I saw his face it's like he has amazing face and the hair yeah. it's like okay um let me risk it one time just one, one time. Th- yeah kikata mm-hmm. it's oh, it's easier yeah, yeah. yeah. so that starts what led me like to give him a chance yeah. plus <laughs> he's, he's, he's a good, he's guy. A good guy yeah mm. okay when he broke the news that uh, we can now date mm-hmm. Ulim jibu immediately ama you kept him waiting I was actually the one who ah, asked him So bro yeah. <laughs> after we kwambia mzee mimi naona we can date ama yo ulimpe punchline again Ni muuliza to like hmm? can you be my boyfriend yeah. that question So bro did you reply immediately ama ulimweka waiting kidog Uh, I replied immediately cause mm. aradi kukutana na best yangu mm. n- nilikuwa na yeye mm. so ndo nikamwambia ati ah, anaitwa Abubakar mm. so like nikamwambia eh mm. tukagotiana mm. akamsalimia ndo nikamwambia this is my girl mm. so at the back of my head I was like eh ata react aje mm. but atuja make it official mimi nishasema ni my girl <laughs> eh yeah. so like later on namulizanga na anasema ati alisikia vizuri so ndo like baadaye baadaye <laughs> ndo akaambia there's something I want to ask you can be okay what is it ndo akaambia ati will you be my boyfriend so you know it was ile enye mm. you two have feelings for each other mm. but bado mjambiana mm. eh, you can literally see mm. this girl okay she's kind of like fond of me mm. and then i'm fond of her and she kind of like knows it uh, mm. eh, so when i called her my girlfriend mm. before actually asking her to be my girlfriend mm. she kind of like ala sema this kia vizuri cause i could niliona vile ali smile then later one akaniambia mm. and i just i say yes yes yeah. yeah that's amazing so uh karibu <laughs> nikuite 
Lakini I don't know Masi Deno. Okay, Stephanie. What was now the impression? Your impression now this boy after just to say it's okay we can I can be your boyfriend. Uli react aja hapo sasa. I was excited yeah. and happy yeah. because I'm making a step. Yeah. A huge step. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so it's like yeah. Before I was like yeah. what will he say will he say wait or mm-hmm. let me think about it mm-hmm. or like mm-hmm. guess mm-hmm. so I was like expecting positive positive yeah. Mm. Yeah. so when he when he said yes immediately I was like okay yes, yes. now I'm yeah. in the direction <laughs> you know yeah you know it's difficult huh? I thought say my mean make at them then I say my yes wanna shindo what next what next So step yako next ilikuwa gani after me say yes. I'm to just give him all my love. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah. Haga ma ulimpedi immediately. We actually hugged uh-huh. and then and then we smooched. <laughs> okay. Uh that was a side sasa at least we've known you baka mali at least Maria Maria kwanza yani impression ya kwanza tushaipata. Now bro, what do you want to do in future? Individual career wise yani kwa career unataka kufanya nini huko mbele? Um personally I'm doing engineering. I'm doing automotive engineering. So like the bigger picture I have is owning my own garage where people can come like fix your car, maybe you want to customize your car because you know you have to think big, you know. So you manifest as early as you can. And as a kid, this this show nilikuwa na uchingi inaitwa West Coast Customs. Eh uh, so to those who are curious you can go to youtube and check west coast customs the it's an american company where like our artists wakubwa wakubwa you know they take their cars hapo you know then zina tengenezwa so like it's really nice plus you know it's and the country is going right now it's not easy to get employed and even if you get employed mara kuna shida your payment is delayed and all that but you know this is instant you fix my car and i give you your money you know yeah. or you bring your car i customize it for you or i do anything you want at the end of the day you get to pay me it's not monthly yeah. so like that's personally i'm in the engineering sector <laughs> so much intelligent have you ever disclosed this to her ma leo to your mamoksem no she's been knowing that ever since yeah, yeah. You've been knowing all this. Yes. Ida changia kwa level flani kwa mapenzi yako kumpenda zaidi ama Yes, I see he's a responsible and principled guy who yeah. knows what he wants. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So that's him. Mm. We now come to you. What do you want to do in future career wise as your career? What are you going to take? Um I'm pursuing accounting yeah. which is very nice. Yeah, yeah. Because every business owner needs an accountant, mm, mm. so like there's a high chance yeah. <laughs> he's going to employ me. <laughs> so you see, yeah. there's like you are assured of a paycheck, a paycheck yeah. every single month or weekly. It depends on your yeah. boss or your employer. Yeah. So I'm pursuing accounting, and yeah. it's a, it's a nice it's a nice course. Yeah. Wow. A couple maze we are going to see it in the next 100 years it is it will be just an amazing couple because abu if he becomes the ceo you are the accountant there hey. A family business. <laughs> <A> family business. <laughs> so bro, what is this one thing that catches your attention? Or you see rais mtu kama unapita pale dem tu anakuita then unaenda and you know you are dating ama boys tu fulani wako pale wameketi ukikuona wanakuita hii Chris vipi nini nini? What is this one thing that catches your attention ili upe mtu time yako muanze kuongea? Um first of all is the way like you handle yourself. Like You know there's a way you can there's that first impression. Yeah. First impression really matters and you can't give a first impression twice. Yeah, yeah. So like there's a way you can look at someone and you look like this person kind of like looks serious and stuff. Yeah. Because 
you might look you might look like you're a joke but in real sense you actually are serious and you might look serious but in real sense somebody might realize that this is a joke it's just wasting my time and all that so like she 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 looked like a principled person and i like the way she carried herself and eh just evil to eh so be tuseme kuna boy tu anapita pale na kuite kitu gani utaona ya kwanza yenye inaweza catch attention yako ongene the way he approaches mm hakuna kitu yenye mtu akisema inaweza feel special the way he approaches me is like kuna choice of words you can use someone seems rude or seems like not polite and there's some other words you choose and they seem polite so yeah. he chose the polite word so i saw it like ah he is polite, polite yeah. yeah and the way he approached it, i approached me yeah. was very disciplined yeah, yeah. you see yeah. yeah so you automatically know this person is principled yeah, yeah. i really like that so there's this uh this question this question this question uh Uh, 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 uh. before we met you told me you know about loyalty tests yeah. yes have you ever been in a position to think one day one day to nitaamka na niambie hii boy acha tuende tusanitize you no <laughs> no <laughs> bro have you ever thought like kuna siku tu nitaamka asubuhi nimwambie babe let's go for sanitizer um uh, uh, i've never thought of it because Like I said earlier we live together. So like utapata sometime she's like nani ame to text and you know it's like my phone. Nani ame to text hebu nione. You see and then um we would like use each other's phones. So generally it's kind of like a self sanitization type of thing. Yeah so like uh, it kind of like eliminates it. Yeah because okay yeah we'd see it on YouTube uh, like the Pluto and um There's another There's another YouTube I like watching. It's from US though. It's yeah. called DDG. Yeah. So you would do loyalty tests, gold digger pranks yeah. on people. Yeah. Uh, so like it's kind of like self sanitization like you would look at my phone yeah. nini. Yeah. Obviously I I would I had female friends, right? Yeah. Then she would be like I'm not comfortable with you talking to this one. I'm not comfortable with you talking to this one. You had history yeah. nini. Yeah. So you know she's kind of like that tough headed like tough love yeah. that it's not at it oh, sawa wewe ndio tu kuongelesha tu but ina muuma yeah. she be like me staki me na ni uma you don't talk to them and then if she you reach the point like yeah. she would even go to their instagram profile yeah. unfollow remove from follow <laughs> block and block follow accounts yeah. ni, 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 yeah. and all that yeah. and eh hey, ilikuwa hivyo tu even yeah. uh cause i actually also broke up with my girlfriend and sometime sometime like mbele we had we had not to to meanza to be she actually called me mm-hmm. i didn't save the number man sasa nikashika and i'm like hello nikaeka speaker mm-hmm. yeah, like sasa i'm mm-hmm. like poa you gonna be get to come be good night <laughs> so i'm like oh, sawa nikakata then i'm like mbona nanipigia kuniambia good night we are nine nambia that's my ex girlfriend from the voice in yeah mm. it's like kwani ni nini kambia hakuna it's like kwani mnaongea mla hapa na mimi hata simuongelee shangi you see so like we, we used to have hizo hizo she called on several locations eh yeah. yeah. added to the point i told her that look i we 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 went our separate ways things didn't work for us bro. well plus i had you went back to your ex i don't know why you're calling me yeah. for some reason please let's just go our separate ways So ivo to ni self sanitizer ndio tulikuwa tunafanya si ati tulikuwa tunasema ibo acha tuangalie simu ya huyu nilikuwa ni ivo to like my phone iko hapo anatumia cuz even her fingerprint was on my phone and all that so eh uh, hey, mapenzi jamani so okay in every relationship there's that one person mwenye ako annoying and hata kama uko polite aje there's something that and una feel kuna kitu anakuwa annoy nayo yeye pia kuna sometimes unamwa annoy but there's this person when he is the most annoying one in a relationship who is that one in you when you are most annoying it is me yeah. mm. and i'm going to most annoying bro hey 
ni nini sasa inakuwa annoy all time all time as it okay it's not the annoying ile ya kukasirika it's just the annoying of okay wewe nda kufanyia nini sasa you know like mmetumie tumetulia one time anaanza kukuuma mgongo kukuuma shingo wewe like nini nini shingo yako inaka vizuri so like what you seriously biting my neck cuz inaka vizuri like eh ivo ivo tu yo mara mabega eh but it's the annoying type ile and when she you, you when you sit down to you say, to think of it mm. if she stops you'll ask by the why do you stop doing why? this why? Yeah. but how did she ask me i'm annoying i'm like eh hey, <laughs> guess you are annoying mm. but i always assure her it's not the, it's the cute kind of annoying because you know pia if you don't assure a, a, a lady mm. you know she'll start thinking that guy he doesn't like what i'm doing i'm trying to show him my love yeah. He doesn't appreciate you know but one of them yes it's annoying but he's a cute kind of annoying and she's embraced it and anafanyanga tu yeah usia ya cha una na cute boy eh we okay hata nashinda na uliza dini and you other question that you need to offer okay given one last day to live what's this one thing you can do as a couple um Uh, we will finish our bucket list we have a bucket list as couples like yeah. things to do yeah. that's you now you have us so like five yet yeah uh-huh. so i'll maybe go for uh, skydiving mm. fear, face my fear yeah uh-huh. yeah <laughs> hello for bro what will you do? what's that one thing you'll do the one thing i'll do um it's also a bucket list you know bucket list is like the things you want to do before you die so i also have this fear of i don't know if it's a fear or a pet peeve like deep sea i'm very scared of the deep sea uh, but heights not that much because as a kid i growing up i actually wanted to do aviation i wanted to be a pilot but there's kind of like a scaffold i didn't end up finishing with geography my sasa since i did physics i was like ah, let me do engineering it's also a good course yeah. so i would, I would face my fear I'd probably go deep sea diving <laughs> eh yeah. before you die eh yeah, before i die yeah. at least i shall have known that i at least i conquered one fear yeah one hey. it's an amazing one so uh stephanie yeah. apart from swahili and english which other language do you speak best Seriously I do not know my native language. Yeah. But I can speak Kamba. Kamba. Yes. Uh, and you tell him I love you ko Kamba. Oh my. Okay. Um Don't tell me for God. Ah, I'm remembering, I'm remembering. Okay. Ni kwende temuno. I think so it's it's that one. Nikwendete <laughs> muno. Yes, I think it's that one. Wakamba uh, help us. Yes, yes. Wakamba yes. help us. Uh, okay. If she's right. Yeah. Down in the another, another one. This one this one is this one can be a, Okay, tell him I want you to buy me a new shoes. In Kamba. Yeah. Oh. I'm adding your one language. Which I know you speak it very well but you don't know it's a language. <laughs> Um okay. New shoes. How do you say? <laughs> I don't know. don't know. Yeah. Okay. Do you know kissing is also a sign language of love? Yes. Do you know how to speak that? No. No. I do not know how to speak it. Huh? She, you know how to, she knows how to speak she's kind of like shy but she does know how huh? how how do you say new shoes wait oh yeah yeah <laughs> <laughs> i remember yeah what's this one behavior that you like to change from one another kuna ile kuna ile behavior mtu alizaliwa nayo hajai change lakini mngetamani ku change from one another Um I say his pettiness. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> pettiness. <laughs> It's not a bad kind of yeah. pain, yeah. but yeah. 
Sometimes it's annoying. Mm. Sometimes. Yeah. What's this one thing you like would like to change the behavior? Behavior yake moja ungependa ku change again? Um Sometimes sometimes she's bossy. You know, sometimes she's bossy hadi anakushautia, hadi like Then she's like ni 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 like I must mean shoutia then ana kuja anayeke and she's like aki sorry i didn't mean to uh, but you know you, you guys get to solve it but sasa unajua continue to continue hadi like kai siku sina shinda na shouti wangu tu kwa nini umekosea yapi but eh eh hiyo tu Stephanie your hidden talent um i really know how to draw mm-hmm. yeah That's a hidden talent. Mm. You bro. Um hidden talent. Yeah. That's one question ni meshindwa ngo kujibu. What's your talent? Mm. Hidden one. Yeah. Yeah. Ni sasa unajua. Okay. Unajua kuna sometimes you know unaweza fanya kitu fulani lakini uwezi kuifanya public. You know. For me I can pray in English nikiwa na pray kindani ndani lakini kiambiwa ni pray mbele watu nashindwa that's my hidden talent okay you have a talent that's hidden unaona mm. ukifungua kwa nyumba you can play football mpaka dunia ataishangaa uh, hidden talent <laughs> maybe to some extent i'd say kind of like dancing i can't dance in public yeah, that is one thing but ever since i got comfortable with her you know I said like, "Hey, Kumbe, you can dance. You dance for what?" I'm like, I "Dance for people. Are like, you crazy? <laughs> I ain't dancing for no people. I'm 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 shy in public." So, eh. Okay. This one is too personal like any. At least ni za saidia mahali, si ndio? What's the longest period you can survive with a dry spell? I will say like three months. Hmm? Three months. Yes. Uh, yes. Is this is while dating or even before dating okay like general general yeah Three months na wewe bro ah uh, me mm. i i'm going like I'll, i'll say probably one and a half two max months yeah two tops mm. two months yeah. at most so if you got a scholarship and was study for four years mm. Uh, itakuwaaje unaweza mwambie nita survive huko na mtu mmoja alafu but our relationship ibaki that never works yeah. never works so at the end of it years. at the end of it all yeah. you know you'll tend to love one person more than the other yeah, yeah. and preferably if you've decided to have a relationship with someone else yeah. you know probably there's one thing ile atakufanyia that your girlfriend doesn't do and you're like huh? I think my girlfriend has never done this for me and she's doing this and I like it. And then at the end of it all it breaks. Then if she also decides hivo akona akona mtu unaona eh so I I I'd be familiar for four years. Plus it's not like all those for maybe probably who knows maybe at the end of the semester at the end of the year you might come back even if it's for a week you know. Vacations. Kuna vacations and you can come back. <laughs> yeah. What is his best meal? A pizza. Mm. He likes pizza you so know much. To... No. Mm. So But kuna YouTube. Mm. Kuna YouTube. <laughs> best meal your mama again. Rice and peas. Rice and peas. Mm. Yeah. Unajua kuitengeneza kuna YouTube. Kuna YouTube. Best meal your mama again. Rice and peas. <laughs> so koi period ya umeka hapo moja what's this thing you've learned from your boyfriend being patient yeah. i've never been patient yeah. but he taught me how to be patient yeah, yeah. bro me landin kutoka kwake um she taught me better communication yeah, yeah cuz you know kuna ile instance yenye unaongelesha mtu hakuna yeah. venye ataichukulia and then naone eh, mtu ananiongelesha vibaya kumbe you didn't mean at all kuumiza mtu yeah. So like she's always taught she's ever since she started dating she's always taught me good choice of words like usiambie mtu hivyo it's better heru mwambie hivi hivi na hivi yes. now as we finish at least uh, we've had a very uh, fruitful conversation with you guys yani i've never had a couple kama nyinyi and i'm very proud of you yani naombea sana you naombea yani relationship yenu kwa very strong is you conquer all the hindering some as in it was yeah so uh you said maybe in the near future you love a channel and uh 
will be in touch. Yeah. Whenever you give me a link, I'll be sharing to my people and uh, I'll, I'll be at least involving my audience on your content. So I'd like you to talk to people who will be, in future, they'll be your fans too. No, no. So Neza Angelesha, you tell them their Insta, your Instagram handles or follow and all that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> me okay you can follow you can follow us on instagram at hood rich royalties and we're also planning on opening a cloth brand which we will talk more about so our instagram handle i've given you we will drop our youtube channel soon with contents you guys will like give us things we should like do or discuss as a couple yeah that's from stephanie Stephanie, yeah (laughs) (laughs) Uh, so for me uh, the instagram handle is hoodrich royals um we actually have a youtube channel but we've not uploaded anything yet yeah, so it's Hoodrich Royalty. Um, email is the same, Hoodrich Royals. Um, so far, that's it. We have an Instagram, uh, email, email, and YouTube. But we'll be posting more content very soon. And then about the brand, we're still kind of like planning on like re- releasing merchandise, you know. So. Very soon, there are going to be jeans, jumpers, sweatshirts, sweatpants, and all that. Even, you know, don't have to be even dresses. And um, who knows, maybe even socks. Someone can customize, you can customize shoes, you see. So, the, 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 the cloth line is still an idea that we're still, we're, we, we're planning to bring back. Because... They, like I said, this YouTuber called DDG, yeah. he once said, if you have an idea, yeah. let that idea come to life. Because who knows, that idea might be might become something big. Yeah. Who knows, the person maybe who created Louis Vuitton, Chanel, Gucci, it was just an idea of, uh, I have this idea of a Versace, Gucci, let me try it out. And you see, they're like one of the biggest cloth lines and Fashion Nova and all that. So it's still an idea, but we're planning to bring it out to life. If it works, well and good. If it doesn't work, we also say we tried. We can, we can try something else. Yeah. Wow, that has been very interesting from the hood rich royalties. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. Hood rich rolls. So I'll, 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 I'll type that uh, name on the video, and. Uh, I'll try and get their link to their Instagram or even the YouTube account and pin it on my first comment as my first comment. So thank you guys for watching this video and uh, I hope you like this video, comment and share to others. As always, we do our things in a savage way. If you can do it professionally, then 